If all are in agreement, I will outline my plan to retake Doma Castle. First, Lys and the Doman Irregulars will conduct a series of raids against Imperial targets throughout the surrounding area, with the aim of drawing the garrison's attention. Shortly thereafter, our Zayla allies will launch a surprise attack on the castle's airborne defenses. In this way, we will prevent the enemy's airships from rendering support and cut off one means of escape. Alize and I, together with the Shinobi, will exploit the ensuing chaos to infiltrate the Moon Gates and disable the Magitek field generators. Once the barrier is down, we will be free to cross the One River and reach Doma Castle. It is at this point that we must turn to our Confederate and Kojin allies. They will commence to bombard the castle with cannon fire while sailing west towards the Doman Enclave. Wait, the Enclave? Why would you want them to sail away from the castle? Because the Enclave is home to countless civilians. Once pressed, the Imperials may well think to take them hostage, and I would fain forestall any such attempt. After we have secured the Enclave, we may lay siege to Doma Castle directly. The main strength of the Doman Liberation Front, under Lord Hien's command, shall be committed to this endeavor, as will you and your redoubtable allies. The rest is simple. We scour the castle for the Viceroy, we find her, and we subdue her. Without their leader, what remains of the Imperial's morale will crumble, and they will surrender or attempt to flee. Doma will be free. Your thoughts, Lord Hien? If any points were unclear or gave you cause for concern, I should be glad to go over them with you. Nay, tis a fine plan. You have a talent for it. We shall carry out Alphano's plan to the letter. Time is of the essence, as you know, so let us each see to our respective preparations. Carry on. <laughs> 